everyone this is VJ and today I'm going to show you a thousand dollar food setup gaming PC for just you guys so first of all uh, if you haven't subscribed my channel yet please subscribe my channel uh, because these these are the builds uh, I build each and every time for the people living in US so uh, let's begin with our past shall we so first you can see on my screen uh, it's an AMD octa core processor FX 8370 uh, it's a 4 GHz uh, clock processor, 32 nm architecture, it's turbo boost to 4.3 as well and the best thing about it is a 8 core, 8 threads processor and uh, it's come with a rack cooler uh, basically uh, it's somewhat different with the stock cooler which comes with a FX8370 it's uh, more cooler, less noisier that's what about rack cooler, it's all about it. So it's a black edition and you get uh, for $209.99 so this basically uh, gives you a brilliant editing as well as gaming that's why I go for this what about the PC is all about so for $210 you know is the best deal and next you can see on my screen I go with the AM3 supported chip uh, so with the motherboard uh, MSI Gaming 970 AM3 Plus uh, what our process also supports and basically uh, it got 4 dim slots support up to 32 GB uh, frequency at 2133 overclock and it got 2 way SLI 2 way uh, AMD crossfire you know USB 3.0 and uh, these are the basic things set at 6 GBPS set at 3 GBPS you know these are the basic things and uh, we gonna overclock this uh, so with a very base frequency if you want extreme overclocking I have to tell you you have to opt for an IPA 2 and 2 EVO so uh, in our case we gonna simply overclock at a frequency it, uh, 4.5 because it uh, gone to turbo boost to 4.3 of a processor what I'm talking about so 4.5 gigahertz is simply outstanding so if you want uh, extreme overclocking so you need a good water cooler so I'm not included uh, and by the way uh, if you don't want to overclock nothing no one is forcing you to be overclocked and the uh, next thing as you can see on my screen is the G skill rip jaws for the RAM 16 gigs to 8 gigabyte stick so clock that's 1600 megahertz and 16 gigs ram of a thousand dollars and a full setup gaming pc man it's really interesting um, because uh, 8 gb is enough but uh, i also uh, keep in my mind the future upgrade options as well so you can uh, go for an 8 gigabyte stick but uh, 16 gigabyte for me is the way to go here as it uh, really works in editing as well as gaming if you uh, like uh, playing in a very decent settings and uh, very decent resolution it helps especially in editing 16 gigabyte is make a difference and today uh, the new games take advantages of uh, more um, RAM so the kind of uh, 16 GB now uh, gonna be very important nowadays so these are our RAM slots for this $56 and I go with the uh, SSD as well for the faster boot time, loading times, writing and reading speeds as well I go with the ADATA USA Premier 240GB uh, it's best to put your OS in it as well as some games because the file size nowadays for the games is really big but uh, for around $59 it's the best deal out there for the 240 GB and you want that and next uh, for our master I go with the Seagate 2 terabyte uh, 6 GB VS 7200 RP RPM hard drives got a 64 MB whopping cache so for that price around 72 dollars it's a steal man you can go for it and uh, next as you can see on my screen the very most important uh, thing that's our graphic I go the GTX 970 MSI GeForce Gaming 4G 
uh, and the best thing is about it is uh, come with a pre-clogged mode uh, like uh, overclocked gaming mode and the silent mode the overclock based clock is 1140 and goes to boost clock 1279 and in gaming mode it's come with 1114 megahertz and goes to 1253 and it's under clock at silent mode uh, 1051 the base and boost is 1178 OGV GDR5 and the memory is 7010 MHz and it's a DX12 ready and it's got Dual Link DVI1 and it's got Dual Link DVI-D1 uh, 1 HDMI, 1 Display 4, these are the 4 uh, video output functions and uh, for the price uh, what you can see um, around $320, uh, $324 uh, first I have to tell you that uh, you can see this uh, as you can see on my screen uh, $324 and uh, it's got a mail in rebate as well and a free copy of Division so it's a steal man uh, for the price knocking down to $304, $305 so that's it and this uh, graphic for the uh, graphic card you can play at very decent settings at 1080p uh, this thousand dollar gaming PC are meant to be played in uh, 1080p at ultra settings or very high settings. If you go to for the higher resolution like 1440p, you can also play it with a very decent settings, high settings. And if you want to 4K, you want to low down the settings because of the high resolution. You can play each and every latest games out there or future aspect uh, comes into place here. So each and everything, uh, if you saw. Uh, this GTX 970 is a value of a car and next because it's a full setup gaming PC guys as you already know um, these um, are monitors uh, step tier E225-1920 black 22 inch monitor it's a TM panel with a 5ms response time 5 million is to 1 uh, contrast ratio 1080p 16 is to 9 uh, aspect ratio it's got built-in speakers as well for around hundred dollars is the best out there it's got one HDMI one DSUP one DVI out there to uh, get the maximum support as per the cable point of view so for that price man uh, for an, an ten hundred hundred dollars is the best uh, what you can find in thousand dollar gaming PC and uh, Next is our CM Storm Devastator. This is our gaming mouse and keyboard combo for just around $27. Uh, uh, but you can go for uh, red backlight as well, green backlight as well. I don't for I don't go for colors. I only uh, believe in performance, so that's why I go for this uh, two dollars less than a red one or green one. And uh, it's got blue LED backlighting on keyboard as well, multifunctional uh, ergonomics, rubber side pads, 2000 dpi, and uh, that's good uh, for the price around $28. A good combo here. So, next, uh, our power supply here. Uh, we go, I go with the EVGA 700 for 80 plus bond certified. Uh, from EVGA what you can best find for the price for $60 man This is really three years uh, warranty from EVGA. It's a certified very good company and uh, $700 more than enough for our build and you can add uh, Some more parts if you want Like an SSD if you want you can have some uh, combo with the uh, hard drive as well so these are the basic things we can go and we're gonna overclock in future if you want if you uh, I said already that if you want uh, higher overclocking you gonna need a good cooler for that you need a good power supply as well to set it up so these for uh, power supply and last but not least uh, with the case cooler master N200 micro ATX mid tower uh, it's it's beautiful uh, for the price just around fifty dollars. Um, it also comes with a two pre-installed fan, extra flow fans. I have to say 120 mm in front as well as in the rear, and you can also put uh, 240 mm radiator as well. 
power uh, processor if you want it also supports here if you go for the feature of creativity uh, point of view if you want radio 240 mm you can install it on the front and if you want uh, 120 mm radiator you can uh, go for it as well on the rear uh, for just around uh, 50 dollars is the perfect bank for the bug so that's it guys uh, for this April 2, 2016 uh, $1000 full setup gaming PC for just you guys I hope you all like it and uh, if you like my stuff please subscribe my channel for more and uh, that's it uh, thanks for watching bye for now Vijay signing off